What is up everybody? Thank you for stopping by the channel once again. You know, today I was going to do like a whole outfit kind of, uh, you know, visual thing for you, but um, it is just way too hot. Once again, California summer fires, all that stuff has reared its ugly head. There, uh, California is literally on fire right now. It's 110 degrees, there's a heat wave. I just couldn't do it. I put on one shirt to try and do the video and I was instantly just drenched in sweat. So today will be a picture book kind of day, which is much easier to uh, kind of visualize. <laughs> With that being said, for today's video, I wanted to uh, do something incorporating color, how to style color, maybe color blocking, whatever the title is going to be. It's going to be incorporating color. I think that that is a lost art when it comes to putting together clothing. I think it is very, very underutilized. So we're going to delve a little deeper into the color thing. I'm not a scientist, I don't know about any of that stuff. I'm not gonna do the color wheel or anything like that, but there's three different things that I consider um, when it comes to styling color, and that's what we're gonna talk about. The first one being monochromatic outfits. That is creating outfits with the same color, but different tones of that color. So that's gonna be um, browns, whether you have dark brown, light brown, cream you get the point when it's the same color different shades different tones of that color that make up the entire outfit this is a very sleek very sexy very easy way to put together an outfit and look really really good and not only that it's also very minimalistic which is huge right now you don't have to put a ton of effort into it like i said it's just the same color with different shades and it looks absolutely amazing. The second way to style color, in my opinion, is one of my favorites, and that is the statement color. This one can get a little hard because you don't wanna start putting together so many different just loud pieces of color. What you wanna do with a statement color piece is find that statement piece, whether, let's say, a jacket. Underneath it, keep everything neutral, keep everything toned down. If you have a bright orange or a bright printed jacket, wear like a white t-shirt and black pants underneath or a black tee, black pants. Keep it very neutral, keep it very minimal underneath. That way the statement piece is doing that, just that being the statement of the outfit. That is why I like this type of outfit so much because the color itself is going to pop, it's going to look amazing, but you yourself are going to stand out as well. It's gonna be subtle enough to just be a nice, cool, calm, collected outfit, but it's going to stand out also just enough to where you know, you're know you not gonna be blended in with the crowd. You're gonna have people kind of you know looking at you and be like, oh, I really like that jacket, where did you get it? So a nice little blend of both with this. If you go too crazy, you might look like a clown and you don't wanna do that. <laughs> Now the third way that I style color personally, um, you could probably consider this color blocking or the easiest way to color block, but I call this one complementary colors. Now I'm not gonna get into the science of it. I don't really even really do the whole color wheel thing. There's plenty of other videos that you can watch here on YouTube that delve more deep into color theory. I don't, I'm not into that. I just wear what I think looks nice together. But in general, complementary colors are just that. A lot of people kind of have their color palette that they lean towards when it comes to outfits or colors. Mine personally is very earthy tones, very like dark maroon with brown with cream. They're not in the same house, they're not in the same color world, but they all mesh and flow together so effortlessly that the outfit, when put together, looks amazing. This is where you can start to do some color blocking and really really fine tuning some amazing outfits where all these different colors from these different spectrums and stuff like that really come together and you make some really nice outfits. I tend to gravitate towards like reds, maroons, greens, browns, creams, beige, that kind of stuff. And when you put them together and they all complement each other, it's like a well-oiled machine. Like all the gears and cogs just kind of start to flow together and you're gonna look amazing. And this is my favorite way that I like to style um, color. 
So there you guys have it. Those are some ways that I look at color, how I style color, how maybe you can incorporate color into your wardrobe, whether it be uh, statement pieces, whether it be the complementary colors, whether it be the monochromatic looks. Those are all amazing ways to um, upgrade from just like a normal black outfit or a white outfit. I think this is an amazing way that you can make some outfits that you might not have thought of in the past. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Hopefully gave you some inspiration. I'll be talking to you guys soon. All right, bye.